After two tropical disturbances developed over Guam this month, they have both safely moved away. And after nearly two weeks of clouds and rainy weather, things are looking a little brighter. And if this keeps up, it'll be time to head back to the beach. <laughs> been several weeks since I've been out for a walk and I was feeling a lot better this morning. I've been through two rounds of uh, epidural injections over the last couple of weeks and I've been told to just take it easy and let them things work and uh, so this morning I decide I'm going to walk today and it's raining. That's okay. I plan on getting a little sweaty anyway. But I'm heading to the beach. Where there's a big, uh, well, there's a coastal cleanup going on this morning. But uh, it's hard for me to participate in that anymore because I can't, I can't bend down and pick up stuff. I can. I can bend down and pick up a beer, but I can't bend down and pick up a bunch of empty beer cans. Not over and over and over. It just tears me up. But after the coastal cleanup, there is a uh, big sand castle competition going on today at the beach. So I'll be there in about five minutes. One of the most upscale apartment or condo complexes in all of Guam. Got their own chickens. And a proud rooster. Keeping them all in check. Smile! Smile. You can catch them. There's all the rain just moved over us. It's moving that way. This is what the rest of the day should look like. see from here but the coastal cleanup I mentioned earlier right down there the parking lot's full there's a bunch of people on the beach and uh, they's picking up the garbage be there in a sec Terry left at about 6 30 this morning got Tai Chi at 7 that's probably what I should be doing Tai Chi old body can't play racquetball anymore well I haven't tried since having my recent round of back issues but um, it's feeling okay the uh, steroid injections I got the last few weeks have knocked the pain down about half um, but I just don't think I'm gonna push it on the racquetball court so maybe pickleball the Tai Chi definitely would help. Hey, I'm down at the bottom of the hill. And it stopped raining. And the sun's coming this way. So, on Guam, that means things will be dry in an hour and it'll be heating up. I hear jungle drums beating mm -hmm. 
And I don't see no sign of Tai Chi people. Hope she didn't decide to disband when the rain started. That means I gotta walk all the way home. That's okay. Checking the sights. Good morning. I don't see no Tai Chi people. They probably stopped when it started raining. And uh, it's so much for me catching a ride back up the hill. That's okay. It'll hurt to burn an extra pound. Hmm. Well, I don't see Terry's car. I think she bailed on me. But that's okay. There's a sandcastle competition getting ready to take place. I might check that out. I think we got music playing down here today too. I might go home and get me my cooler on the lawn chair. Beach chair. Just come back and sit down in the tropic shade. Be a busy place for uh, to be in the park this morning. Or I think the sandcastle competition starts around 10. But they've got a lot of vendors already here, food truck vendors. And uh, we've got some tents set up. And there will undoubtedly be food, which I will not be partaking in today. Castle building has already started. I think the main the main draw is at about 10. And it's about 7.30 right now. So I'm just gonna walk around and shoot some video. So what are y'all building? Building? Looks like Matsumoto Castle. No? Yeah. Can't be, I'm kidding. It's a turtle. What, what is it? A turtle? Oh, how long will it take you? Two hours? Wow. Well, turtles are slow anyway, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back, check it out. Thank you. What are you guys building? Turtle. Another turtle? Yeah, it's a little... Something like that. Oh, yeah, they're building a turtle too, huh? Most likely. Yeah, I think that's what they said. <laughs> Everybody building turtles? Mm. No? Damn. Let's hope, let's hope not. Hope not. Should build like, somebody needs to build a sand castle. Yeah. Yeah. How long will it take you, you think? How long will it take you? An hour. An hour? Okay. Yeah, definitely an hour. You'll get to beat them because they said two hours. <laughs> well, we're not doing it. We're not doing it. <laughs> a turtle with a mermaid. What do you call this? This is uh, this piece. It's called the sad mermaid. The sad mermaid. No. I don't know. She's no. She's just gazing. I don't know. I'm trying, we're trying to figure out a name. We don't know yet. Mermaid in paradise. Mermaid in paradise. There you go. Mermaid in the turtle. 
the tour the tortoise and the, <laughs> the tortoise and the mermaid yeah <laughs> so uh, i think it's selena it's the local you guys must have started early selena, huh sure. we started yesterday morning oh yesterday morning already mm -hmm. wow so we had to get it all pounded up piled up what do you use to keep it all together just water just water only yeah yep water and hopefully hope nothing. it don't rain and yeah, and rain. Just, uh, did the rain come over here a few minutes ago we, bother you? We threw plastic, like a. Oh, you did a, a tarp? Plastic. Yeah, okay. Painted plastic's really light. Yeah. And so you put it on there and make sure you don't have anything tight, just keep it loose. Okay. And the rain hits it and just runs off. Okay, so no damage from the no rain. Damage. Who are you representing? I represent Washington State. Washington State? You don't yes. live in Guam? I don't live in Guam. Cool. And uh, what are you doing here in Guam? I'm uh, sand sculpting, uh, kind of. I'm a professional sand sculptor, and I travel all over the U.S. and and uh, internationally, mostly Canada. Okay. And uh, yeah, and they asked me and another sculptor to to uh, do sand sculpture. We did one at the hotel, uh, EIC. Oh, oh, down here. Yep. Okay. We did one for them, and uh, is it still there? It is. Okay. It is. So I'm gonna walk down there. Near one. the pool. Yeah. And uh, oh, it's inside, off the beach. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we did that, and then uh, now we're on the beach, kind of showcasing some of our work. First time in Guam? First time in Guam. You like it? I love it. Yeah. People here are awesome. Guam is an affliction there's no cure for. Yeah. 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 No, we've had a great time. I mean, everybody's treated us so well. So how many came over with you? Uh, just me and, and just me and him. Just two of you? Yep, Okay. Two. Did the uh, Department of Tourism pay your way? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. They did? Yeah, very well. You can't so. beat that. So it's, it's good. Now you got to go back to the cold, drizzly, rainy weather of yeah. The Northwest. Yeah, but you know, I'm ready for fall. Are you really? I got, yeah, I do. I it carve, never comes here. I carve pumpkins, so. Oh, you do? Okay. So uh, pumpkin carving is what I originally started out with. Okay. And then uh, got into sand and then do chainsaw. Well, this looks good. Chainsaw carving and and uh, just kind of showing what we can do with the sand. The sand is a huge challenge, but uh, you know, it's got to make, just make it work and uh, yeah. Well, this is good. Adapt and so you got a little ways to go on this one now. Yeah, you yeah. Got still got the fins. We got detail. The main, uh, main pieces. We got the the form. Everything done on the shell. The head of the turtle. Detail work. The hair and the detail. You got to do some detail on the hair. Uh, this this sand you can't detail too much. Oh no. It's a uh, very coarse. It has a lot of. You can kind of see. I mean, it has a lot of big pieces in it. Yeah. Okay. Coral and it. It really doesn't have any binder you can't, you in it. You can't really rake it. You'll grab something and tear it up. Yeah, yeah. And there's no binder in it. This, yeah. Uh, this is wet sand, and it's really very little binding. So okay. Um, we can do little details to kind of highlight. Mm -hmm. You got the light and dark. Just little subtleties in the sand can change. Okay. Can create a texture. Um, so yeah, we're just pretty much creating shadows. What's the first place prize? I'm not sure. I, I didn't. There better be something if you come yeah, all those sure, ways. Sure. Yeah. But for us, we're not competing. Oh, you're not? No. We're just showcasing and uh, just showing what can be done in this sand. Okay. Well, hey, yeah. appreciate you talking to me. Yeah. Yeah. What are you building? I'm oh, sorry. Yeah. It's a very quick sketch, but. <laughs> what is it? It's a clan, giant, uh, giant clan. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I see it now. Yeah. Manta, and then Manta's laying on the rock. Wow, that's a lot of detail. Yes. Yeah. I think we can do it. How many hours? When will you be done? At two o'clock, probably. Two o'clock. Yes. <laughs> okay. Well, I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't get in your way. Awesome. Thank you. Good luck. Good, Good luck. luck. Looks like we're going to have a lot of corals, so. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like your neighbor's taking Starting to take shape. What are we building? A turtle? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're doing a hand on the turtle. So turtle suit. Oh, is this a big turtle and two little turtles? Yeah, it's, yeah. Oh, no, no, this isn't turtle. This is a hand. This is what? A hand. A hand. Yeah, this is our concept. Oh, a hand. Yeah. Okay. Wow, nice. Hi. Look at this. You guys got a plan. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
Got to use our digital side. Yeah, it's your digital yeah. side. Yeah, yeah. Good. This looks good. Yeah, you, I mean, you got your lines that you're kind of marking out. Yeah. Um, tapping the sand, like you said, I, I see you guys doing that to help keep it clean is really good. Uh, a plastic bag on your hand to rub the sand and tap it will also smooth out the sand. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay, yeah. okay we'll you like that. And then trap that light. You know, when you get, I see you guys are just roughing it out, which is great. Mm -hmm. And then uh, trap the light underneath it and around it. And that's going to make it nice dramatic. Trap the light? Trap, when I say trap the light, is like you do your cut to create that dark line. So like mm, when you yeah. undercut your turtle, you want to get that dark yeah. line. So it separates from the beach, right? It looks yeah, like it's yeah. sitting on it. Yeah, yeah. And, and the more that you can get those dark lines by cutting a little bit deeper, you can trap the light creek shadow there. Yes, I yeah. see what you mean. That's I what I mean depth, by when I say right? trap the light. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I mean, that's it. our talk. We're talking when we're sculpting. We're like, yeah, trap oh, the light. Because <laughs> yeah. we're only carving, you're only carving in one yeah. color. So you got to... Yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. We do hope you enjoyed it. Please help us out by mashing that like button and don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell. Also, a huge thanks to all our Patreons, who without your support, this channel would not be possible. For real-time updates, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, and X. And always remember, never give up on a dream. And we'll see you next time.